everybody you'll have to excuse the background because i couldn't film in the window because it's quite bright so i chose here so i'm going to be doing summer not well beauty and random essentials so best things for summer and start off with um in summer i use a lot of dry shampoo because my hair is quite it's combination hair it's obviously dyed and it gets quite like yuck sometimes it gets quite greasy so if I'm on the go and I can't get access to a shower I will use the Batiste uh, dry shampoo and I don't like the big cans I like them I don't know why I just have to excuse my lack of talking I've got a wisdom tooth coming through and it really 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 hurts but I've just got this one in floral essences and Smells nice, does the job. Next is a bronzer. I got this bronzer from Christmas and it's the number seven limited edition bronzer. It actually got thrown to the floor and is now kind of broken. I'll show you in just a second. It came with this little kabuki brush, which is kind of cute. Someone threw it on the floor. So it's still, you know, I can still use it. It just kind of looks like this. And I like it because of the different colours. There was five before I got thrown to the floor. There was a, a light goldy brown, a dark goldy brown, a pink, a white gold and a darky coloured pink. But, you know, you're supposed to kind of swoosh the brush around in there a little bit and get them all together. So if they're all crumbled up in there, it don't really matter. You just stick the brush in, do the job, put it on your face, look like a sun-kissed goddess, job done. Next is my foundation and my powder. Um, I might be changing foundation soon because I went to Boots and I was like, to the lady there, I was like, help. Um, I have combination skin, I have dry skin on my forehead and on my jawline, but I have quite What's it called? It's not greasy. No, greasy. What's it? Oily, that's it, oily. So you get oil all down here and just literally just there. So for the time being, I am wearing and using the Rimmel Wake Me Up foundation in the colour True Ivory. I've actually started reusing this again because I used ivory and it's got a bit too pale, so that means I'm tanning. I'm getting my colour back. So this is a little bit darker. And the powder I use is the Stay Matte, also by Rimmel, in the colour Silky Beige. And I like it because when I put my foundation on, I look quite shiny. As soon as I put this on, I look amazing. And it's been quite well loved so far because you cannot see the... I don't know what that's called. The pattern, the, the thing on the inside. And it got a bit broken as well. Kyle doesn't like my makeup so he it on the floor. I'm joking, he doesn't like my Last makeup thingies, doodahs, what have you, are my two Stila eyeshadows. I recently got these and I was so happy. I've got uh, Stila Eden, which is a light dusky pink just looks like that and I got Pigalle I think that's how you say it I think it's a French word I'm pretty sure it is because I speak French and I should know that and it's like a oh it's like a velvety purple red and it's just gorgeous and it's on my eyes and that will close my eyes for you because yeah and it just looks so good together those are the only two there at that precise moment in time so I thought I'll try them together so moving on to accessories these bloody sunglasses look at those beautiful things they're gorgeous and they're white on the inside I don't know why and these are from New Look and these were seven pounds I think so and they're just like a almost cat eye a little bit they are actually, I'm 
not too sure. I was inspired by um, Gabby, Gabriella Lindley, because she looks so good in cat eye sunglasses and I've been told that I can pull them off because of the shape of my face. It, yeah, okay, alright, bear that in mind. So I bought myself a pair, I now have five pairs of sunglasses. But, you know, whatever floats your boat. Next is my snaffles, sandals, that are covered in hair, they can have any pets or anything. And they are gorgeous, they're just these little cuties with flowers on. And I got them in a size 6, and they're from Primark. Primark footwear is quite strange, I could be anything from a 5 to an 8. That's crazy, crazy, crazy. And they're just like a beige base with white, off-white buckle, this bit here, and the flowers are white, but they are quite off-white. And these were, I'm doing a bit of a haul now, if you like any of my stuff, then these were from Primark and they were £6. Um, number 7 bronzer was a gift, so I don't, I'm going to guess about £25 if you're going to buy it. Steeler eyeshadows are actually from TK Maxx and they were £4 each. Um, you can get the Batiste dry shampoo from drugstores and the foundation and the powder drugstores. And over here is my beautiful hat. <laughs> I look a bit daft with my hair up, putting it on. If I take my hair down just a second, oh god it's going to fall off. My hair needed a cut again so I went and got it cut but not too much. So this is my hat. It's actually the same as Lucy... who wore it? Is it Lucy or Lydia? I don't know you might have to check. Lucy and Lydia. Just one word type it into your search bar and one of the girls has this hat and it's awesome from Primark. And I'll say it's about four, four, I can't speak today, four or five pounds. And I think I might keep it on though, actually. Um, my last item is my play suit I am wearing. And I will stand up in a minute. It's just this nice play suit. I like the back. It's got a nice like, open bit just here. And it, it's nice because it doesn't show off your bra strap. It kind of just shows your back and apparently according to Kyle my back is very tanned at the moment so yay. Oh one last thing, my nails. I had my nails done by a family member. I really can't speak today. Family member and they just look like that and the thumbs are like this and they are shellac and I like it because I am so bad for picking nail varnish off. But this one you can't pick off, not very easily anyway. And I went for pink because literally the majority of the clothes I own have got pink on them. So also I've been told it looks nice on tan skin. So yeah, leave me a com comment below what you think of these colours. My mum has said that she prefers this one to this one. I think I agree. I think I like this one. Uh, the light pink is called Celestial, and the dark pink is called, is it Cotton Fluff or Candy Day? No, Cotton Fluff. So, Celestial and, <laughs> is it Cotton Fluff? Yeah, it's Cotton Fluff. Celestial and Cotton Fluff. But yeah, this, this was £5, if you wanted to know that. I don't know if you did. But thank you for watching. I'm going to go... And I still have something to eat now because I'm absolutely starving. Hair's still so long. I got this bit cut as well because it's like my fringe. This this is my fringe here. Look at the length difference. I'm rambling now. Thank you for watching guys. If you like this video please give it a thumbs up and if you're not subscribed already please subscribe. The button is probably here somewhere. It probably is here. Or if the cam's going to turn it around, it's probably going to be here. <laughs> but 
you know, either side. Click it if you like this video, and if you did like it, please thumbs up, and I will be uploading another video very, very soon. Thank you for watching. Bye!